guys, welcome to Nana's Corner. My channel is all about learning to DIY, craft, and cook without spending a lot of money. If that's what you're looking for, be sure to subscribe and then click on the bell when it appears so you won't miss when I upload something new. And if you enjoy the video, please give it a thumbs up to let me know you'd like to see more. Hi guys, welcome to my kitchen. Today we're going to make some hard boiled eggs in the Instant Pot. It seems crazy, but everybody loves hard boiled eggs, but nobody likes to peel them. Let's face it, it's a pain in the booty to try and peel some hard boiled eggs sometimes. So what we have here is six large eggs and I'm going to place them in the Instant Pot. And they are on the trivet that comes with the Instant Pot. We're just going to place them in there and then we're going to add one cup of water to the bottom. Once you have your water in, you're going to put your, make sure that your seal is on good. Put your top on. Make sure your vent is to sealing. And then we're going to put the Instapot on manual on high pressure for six minutes. It'll turn on when it's ready and then it'll come up to pressure. Once it's on pressure, high pressure, it will cook for six minutes. You'll know it's starting to cook when your little pin pops up and seals it. Once it cooks for six minutes, then we're going to do a natural release. You just leave it alone after it beeps and it'll count to six and then we'll release the rest of the pressure. Okay guys, so it's cooked for six minutes and now it's turned off. Go ahead, it'll switch to warm automatically. Just leave it like that and this will start counting upwards. When it starts cooking, it counts your time down and when it's off and done cooking and it's just cooling, your time will go up. So we're going to leave it for six minutes on a natural release. By natural release, this is what I mean. The venting is pointed to ceiling right now. Over here is vent. If you weren't going to do a natural release, you would turn this to venting and force the steam to come out. But we're going to leave it here at ceiling and let the pot cool down naturally and this pin will it'll drop down as the, the pressure in the pot releases we're gonna re leave it like that for six minutes once it reaches six minutes if your pin hasn't dropped then we're gonna go ahead and switch it over to the venting and let the rest of the steam come out so that we can open the pot while you're letting your pot cool down what you will do is you'll get a bowl of cold water and add some ice to it. And once the eggs are come out of the pot, they're going to go directly into the ice cold water. Now you'll see that it's reached six minutes. It's been cooling down. Now you can shut it off. And as you can see, the pin has not come down. So we're gonna carefully move this over to, to the venting. Can you hear the steam that's still coming out? And we'll leave it like that until the pin drops down and it's safe to open the pot. Now that it's safe to open the pot, you're going to twist your top off, listen for that little jingle, 
and then remove it slowly, carefully. Sometimes with eggs, it seems to catch the There we go. And you can take your top off. Now with tongs, you're gonna wanna go in, take your eggs out, and just drop them in to the ice cold water. And then we'll let them sit for at least six minutes. It doesn't have, they don't have to come out of the ice water right at six minutes, but you need to leave them in there about six minutes for them to cool down enough for you to peel them. So I'll be back. Okay, so the eggs have been cooling for about six minutes, maybe a minute more. And we're gonna take them out and we're gonna see how these babies peel up. 99% of the time, they're going to be much easier to peel than if you boiled them on the stove. So let's see. Once you get it started, now of course being on film, it may be a little bit jinxed. But look how easy that comes off. Big pieces. No more struggles. Well, that one stuck a little bit. Well, let's try another one. guys if you like this video give me a thumbs up and if you're new to the channel so please subscribe and click the bell when it comes up so you'll be notified whenever I upload a new video thanks a lot now go eat some eggs <laughs>